Think we got enough? If we run out, we can always call for backup. So, uh, look. I've never been down there before. Down? The water. Diving. Well, maybe you could show me how the pros do it. Are you serious? Uh, yeah. I mean, are you serious you came out here without taking any lessons? Uh, kind of, yeah. I wanted to. I just didn't... I didn't have time, you know? I had to work all summer. Oh, uh, fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> Whoa, careful. That dive cam is, like, super expensive. Look, bro, be cool. What? Julia and Conrad are, you know, how do I say it? Super fucking loaded? So? So don't sweat the little stuff, man. It's not cool. Don't make me regret letting you tag along. Dude, you know I'm not, like the best around new people, whatever. Oh, shut up. Brett, you're not on this trip because you're my bro. I mean, you are my brother, but I mean like we're buddies, you know? Um, kinda. We're just out here to fucking hang, cool out and kick it. What the fuck are you talking about? Let's just kick it and be legends, man. <laughs> All right, amigo, Calvary's almost here. Cool. Sorry I'm a little snappy, I'm just, when you medical school would be stressful, you know? Total shocker. And man, the long distance thing with Julia, it's been rough. Yeah, I got you. It must be tough. No worries, man. Mm -hmm. Huh? <laughs> yep. Right on cue. What? Conrad doesn't think we have enough beer. Ah, I guess I keep these in an undisclosed location. Yeah. Hey, so, uh, can I get your input on something? Yeah, what? Just, uh, kind of a big thing I'm trying to make a decision about. About finishing med school? No, but it's just kind of a big life choice, you know? I don't know what's the right thing to do. Go with your gut. If it's right, you'll know. Connie, this is Alex. Hey, what's up, man? Conrad. <laughs> Watch it, sis. Lady killer, right here. <laughs> Good to finally meet you, Conrad. This is Brad, by the way, my little bro. Hey. Bradley, I feel like I already know you. I've heard so much about you. Yeah, uh, likewise. Miss me? Hey, man. Want to crack a cold one with me? Every second. Huh. Uh, that's a lot of seconds, cowboy. I mean, I would have gone with minutes. Yeah. yeah, cool. <laughs> Tight. Uh, I, I love beer. <laughs> right on, Radical. I like the cut of your ship. It's jib. Don't ruin it. You ever do any diving before? Yeah. Totally. All the time. Nice. I was worried they're gonna stick me with a noob. Oh, uh, nope. Not noob. I can practically breathe underwater at this point. So you uh, dive a lot? A couple, three times, you know, here and there, family trips. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the old crust bucket skipper, anyhow? I'd invite you to make yourselves at home, but, uh... So is everybody on board and ready to go? Uh, you're selling, I'm buying. That 
That's it. Get it all out. Uh, yeah. You uh, want to go lie down? Yeah. You know, maybe I should. Yeah. Oh, boy. See those hot pics. What about over here? That's pretty far out of the way. I'm just thinking about backup targets in case we don't find anything on the dive cam. Listen, to be honest, I've never heard of this wreck you're looking for. Usually these things are crawling with divers. Yeah. This one's different. I'm just saying, if it gets too late, I know some nice places where you can just take, you know, a nice dive. I was so sure it would be here. But yeah, I mean, what are the odds we're really gonna find a needle in a haystack? I'm gonna go help Conrad and Julia with the camera. What you got? Feast your eyes on this. Brad's calculations were right on the money. Always bet on Brad. Yeah, kid's a whiz. We should thank him. Bliss, we found a plane. Yeah? Yeah, it looks like World War II. We are ready to dive. Uh, technically, we should call this in to port authorities as an unreported wreck. Well, technically. Are you sure you don't want to do this the right way? Wait, are you saying we shouldn't dive? The right way. Come on, what is this, kindergarten? I had to bring it up. If we just go down and take a look, who's gonna know? Fine, as long as you're quick. And don't touch anything. Oh, I just can't wait to be the first one down there. Can you imagine, untouched? We should be ready to get you guys in the water in a few. I'll set up the tanks. The boys will do the final checks. Take a look at the camera, see if you can find anything useful. Righto. Hey, maybe you should check on your bro? How you doing? Sorry, that brewski got the better of me. Hey, all part of the adventure. Sorry for putting a damper on things. No worries, dude. Took more than that just to script the trip. Just get some rest. Come back when you're feeling better. You know how to use that? Uh, no, not really. Might want to just let it do its thing. This doesn't look kosher. Almost got the gear good to go. So, thanks again for springing for the good stuff. Nice to be able to do it right. Uh-huh. What? You know the size of my bank account is not in a competition with the size of your penis, right? But if it was a competition, I'd still do pretty good, right? Well, if you adjust for inflation, gotta say, not too happy with our captain at the moment. So, about that, I just wanted to let you know I'm pretty sure her diving license is fake. The seal's like pretty much coming off, and it's got a couple suspiciously misspelled words. Explains why she's acting so weird. Wonder what else she's hiding. Yeah, 
At least we can use it as a bargaining tool if she pulls any more goody two-shoe bullshit on us. But my dad's lawyers would love to hear all about it. All right, I'm gonna get these rebreathers set up and then we'll go through the final steps together. Cool, just holler at us when you're ready. There's a little gap in the tail. Take a look. Hey. Hey, back. Man, we got some good stuff on the camera. Yeah, you did. Hi. You know, we have rules out here for a reason. You guys gotta respect that. Fliss, we paid a lot of money for this particular dive, in this particular spot. Every time I take a group of you people out, it's the same thing. No regard for anyone else's customs. These rules are all pretty basic stuff. How much experience do you have with these kind of dives? How experienced are you? Excuse me? I mean, I know what your fake credentials say, but I don't know the truth. Hey guys, <laughs> tanks are ready. Were you snooping around? Tanks a lot. You don't trust me? The fake certificate is only temporary. My old one expired and renewal out here is like extortion, okay? This dive is supposed to bankroll the fees. But that's not exactly following the rules now, is it? So I guess that applies to all of us. For all you know, this could be a war grave. Disturbing it would be illegal and immoral. Fine, I get it. How much? How much what? How much money will it take for you to stop breathing down her necks? You, <laughs> this is not about the money. <laughs> you know what? I can't stop you. Just respect the rules down there. Don't do anything stupid that'll get my ass in trouble. Okay, so this is the rebreather way cooler than a regular scuba setup. It takes all that CO2 that you'd normally just exhale into the water, and instead, it gets totally reused. Then it reduces decompression time on your way up. State of the art. Okay, O2 check done. Whoa, 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 eager beaver, you gotta check your O2 first. Thanks for sending me straight. Okay, you little clown fishes. I'm gonna go see what Fliss is up to. You behave, Connie. Looking for a first mate, Captain. Let's know. You just don't give up, do you? Are those two going in or what? I know the weight is interminable, but soon. I got the bang stick. Yeah, I heard that about you. Ha ha. You ever have to use one? All right, On kids. a shark? Nope. Good to go. Just remember the rules, please. 
Fliss better not be pissy this whole trip. Yeah, she should remember who's signing the checks. Very large checks. Ought to buy us at least a little wiggle room with the rules. Souvenir would be cool. It's not like one tiny little thing would hurt anybody. I won't tell if you won't. <laughs> not like they can scan the wreck every night at sundown. There. That shape. That's gotta be it. Whoa. That is, like, way bigger than I thought. Damn. It's pretty intact, too. This is a fucking remarkable find. Let's swim around. Howdy, Captain. You fancy a pint with your second in command? You are not my second in command. Third in command? No. Fresh in your cabin, boy. Still a no. Your well paying, dashingly handsome, seafaring client is requesting the pleasure of your company over a frosty amber liquid. Pass. I have to stay focused on your friends down there. Pretty nice ride you got here. Where'd you get the cash? It's a long story. It's complicated and it's really difficult to explain. Well, I'm a complicated guy. Try me. Well, it involves at least several trips to the bank and signing of big stacks of paper with large numbers on them. So you took out a loan. You know, you're smarter than you look. If you're interested, maybe my family can make an investment in your business. That's very kind of you to offer. I suppose we could have that conversation. Uh, you know what? I better spend some time keeping the Duke of Milan ship shape. Aye, aye. Duke to Alex. Duke to Julia. Wow, that is not your everyday wreck. I hope those clowns don't get me in trouble. How's it going? Knocked out by cold frosty. Man, I feel like such a wimp. Hey, it's your vacation. You're allowed to overdo it. I am officially starting a temperance club. Party of one. Lifetime membership. Hope the lovebirds are having the time of their lives down there. 
I hope they know what they're doing down there. Attitude matters 20 meters down. Alex plays the goof, but he was pretty serious about acing his diving certification. What other dives have they done? When I got the booking, I thought they were newbies. Alex and Julia have both logged plenty of dives. I'm the real amateur, but I'm ready. Huh. Gotta get back up top. Check you later. Why do I keep these around? this picture. Hey there, how's it hanging? You look like you're taking full advantage of your relaxation time. I'm a man of many talents. So are you beached? Like a whale? Hey, I just thought, why spend all my time down in the dark when I already like what I see up top? <laughs> nice one. How long you been cooking that one up? All afternoon. Good use of your time. I like to make the most of it. Mm-hmm. I'll see you later. What's that about? Fishing boat, from the looks of it. How should we handle this? This feels off. Just be quiet and don't say anything stupid, okay? You gotta keep back, we've got divers in the water! Hey, we got damage here, you see this? Look at our boat! We can take care of this, man, it's not a problem. What do you think, like, uh, 10 bucks cover it? Oh, whoops, my bad, let's make it 20. Well, shoot, you, you think it's more like 30? I can do 30. All right, you guys drive a hard bargain, but I'm with you. Here, let's just throw in the whole pot. Conrad said one of the pictures showed an opening. Conrad, really? Really. On the rear turret. Huh. Good on you, Connie. The turret. We can get in through there. Ah, 
be dangerous. Uh, ladies first? Can I just take a second to say, holy shit, Alex, we did it. I mean, can you believe it? It's a dream come true. <laughs> Let's not waste any time not exploring. Go, go, go. Julia, leave it. You'd have to take your gear off to get in there. Not worth it. That pipe's pretty tight. What if you get stuck without your rebreather? Don't be such a gonad. I'll be fine. Gonad? Seriously? Am I dead? What's happening? Live a little, Edgelord. You do something stupid down here, that's it. One chance, you get that? Chill out, I'm fine, see? No problemo, 